Hey everyone, how you doing tonight? Uh, tonight? Today is a February 1st, 2017, and that means the release of Topps Baseball 2017 Series 1. Uh, big day for card collectors. Uh, this has been, uh, this is always big time of the year where uh, these things are released uh, probably about two weeks before spring training. Uh, so tonight we're going to be drinking a Stone Brewing Company Tangerine Express IPA, which was also just released uh, recently. Uh, this is in the bottle. I actually had it at uh, one of the Stone um, Brewing Company. They had a little shop here in Pasadena. Uh, I got to try it earlier uh, this, uh, actually earlier in January, and it was delicious. So I was excited to see it um, here in uh, Pasadena at uh, Whole Foods. So uh, I picked it up. So let's break that open, and we're going to break open the uh, top baseball as well. So I really enjoyed this beer, and I was really excited to see it, that it was in the bottle. So I'm just going to position that right there. All right, so, whoop, don't want that. <laughs> okay, so uh, what was really great about uh, the 2017 series is they have a lot of cards of, that they um, did with the 1987 look. So this was the 1987 uh, Topps collection. Just to remind you, had the wood border so there's uh, current cards in this 2017 series with this type of look, which um, if you're a collector, this was uh, a great time to collect. In fact, I got this from Hall of Fame Baseball Cards in Arcadia, California. I want to give a shout out to them. Um, and uh, this is Eric. Uh, this was uh, his favorite year to collect. So he was really excited to see that this was included. So these, these are the 1987 cards. So I just want to give you uh, a little peek at that uh, and we will see them in this. Uh, and there was also these exclusive hobbies. So if you get these from Hall of Fame baseball cards, the shops actually give you with the, this is the jumbo, uh, the hobby jumbo box. And uh, it comes with two of these um, special packs. So I, I would definitely, uh, Try to get them from uh, a, a vendor because you can get these packs. So I'm going to actually open up these right now and take a look at these. And as policy, uh, whenever there's a Milwaukee brewer, we take a drink. That is just house policy. And tonight we're drinking the Stone Brewing Company Tangerine Express IPA. Let me get this open. So these, if I can get it open, super cool car. So let's put these in the light. These uh, only come, get that in focus. So Noah Syndergaard, rookie league, Luke Weaver of the Cardinals, who I'm representing tonight. I'm actually representing the State College Spikes, Class A for the St. Louis Cardinals. Local favorite, Julio Urias. And as you can see, the uh, just really beautiful cars and, and like that 1987 look that I was saying before. Tyler Glasnow. And this one's a little bit different. This this is a rookie card, but this may be, let's look in the back here. Yeah, this is out of, as you see there, it's out of, uh, out of 150. So this is a Topps uh, 1987 look and beautiful cards. So rookie of Tyler Glass now. And that's out of, that's out of 150. Really nice. 
and got the special promotion here, the National Baseball Card Day 2017, which is uh, Saturday, August 12th. A little bit later this year. I, I think it was earlier last year. So let's take a look at the, the other pack here. And again, these only come with with the purchase at a hobby shop. So uh, Hall of Fame baseball cards in Arcadia, California is where I got this. So Gary Sanchez of the Yankees. Let me get that in focus. Josh Donaldson. Oop, let me get that. So just beautiful cards. Phenom Trevor Story was really killing it last year at the beginning of the season. Got hurt late, I believe. Didn't play the whole year, but... And another Colorado Rocky rookie card here, David Dahl. So again, these cards are super nice. Do we have any brewers in there? Don't think we did. But I'm going to break policy and have a drink of this Stone IPA. Delicious. So I'll go back to these cards. But let's open up the hobby box. Now the hobby box has one autograph and two relic cards. Um, so the relic cards are memorabilia that they put into the cards. And um, I will show you what those are when those come up. So again, we're opening Topps Baseball 2017 Series 1 that just came out today. And uh, yeah, if anybody has any questions out there, do please let me know. Each pack comes with 50 cards, so we have quite a few to get through. So let's zip through these. And again, this is the hobby box. So this is the higher higher tier box. So let's move this aside and go for it. Remember, we're looking for brewers. Okay, so let's look. take a look at these. These are, got a really interesting look. Drew Pomerantz, Tyler Clippard, rookie Jac Jacoby Jones, Tyler Flowers. Now I'm just gonna give you a look of some of these. I might flip through some of these pretty quickly later, but you can see the really great design on there. Bit of a 3D look. Got the foil, as you can see. Uh, let me see if I can get that in there. Got that foil stamping. Really nice. Mike Trout. People in Southern California love them. So Mike Trout, I think all of baseball loves Mike Trout at this point. MVP. Let's see if I can. But yeah, just really nice cards. So I'm going to try and flip through these pretty quickly now. See if we can find some of those relics. So we got league leaders here, Arba Pujols, one of my favorite players.
So a refractor card here. Some really exciting designs that I'm, I really like. Got the five tool, Josh Donaldson. Let's see if I can angle that in. Really nice, beautiful card right there. Dan Plesak, nice to see him. I actually really like Dan Plesak on the Major League Baseball Network. So our first autograph, Trey Turner of the Nationals. Let's get that in focus. Trey Turner. So there's your first autograph. I think that that might be is there one autograph in there. So I think we already hit our auto. So we got the relics. Pull that aside. Trey Turner, Nationals. So let's just quickly go through these. These are just base cards. Really liking the design this year. Matt Adams actually saw him recently. Lost a lot of weight. Looking good. So again, this is a 2017 Tops, and I think there's a lot of hidden gems in here. This is only the first pack, and I already hit a Trey Turner autograph. I don't think it was numbered, but let's check it out. Nope, not numbered. Bryce Harper. So that's our first one. Let's go in a second. If there were any Milwaukee Brewers in there. I did not see it. So I should just take a drink for that. Again, enjoying the Stone Brewing Company Tangerine Express IPA. So let me just flip through these real quick, real quick and then kind of get to the meat if I see anything uh, interesting. A lot of base cards here. Daniel Murphy, nice looking card. Felix Hernandez, again, like really liking this. The photography is fantastic. Let me get that in focus. I heard that this was in here. They uh, there's some Father's Day cards and also some Mother's Day themed cards. So this is the Freddie Freeman Father's Day card. A little story about Freddie Freeman losing his mother to cancer, which I did not know. Another five tool, Nolan Arenado. Arenado, excuse me. Just beautiful artwork on there. This is the five tool, third baseman for the Colorado Rockies. So let's see what else we got here. So here's the Oakland A's, Sunny Gray, in that 1987 look, the 30th anniversary of that. So again, exactly the same as it was in 1987. Let's pull that aside. This is also interesting too. I saw this earlier and I saw a, got a Nolan Ryan 
I believe that's a 1970, I want to say, 70 card, potentially. Hope I'm not wrong on that. But interestingly enough, it's really just a promo card. Let's see if I can get that in focus. But yeah, it's just a, a promo card. <laughs> it looks really nice, but it's nothing but a promo. So Tyler Naquin, actually, I believe this uh, shot is from when he hit an inside the park home run. So, again, let's get through this pretty quick. A lot of horizontal cards on this one. Yeah, I don't, I must have missed the Brewer ones. Must have flipped right past them. Maybe I should just make a policy just to drink after every pack opening. All right, pack three. Again, let's just flip through these really quickly. Ah, there we go. Brewers, Willie Peralta. So let's drink up to that. Again, the only thing we've hit is a Trey Turner autograph so far. Tops Legend, Lou Brock. So, Legend card coming up. And the five tool is Mookie Betts. Mookie Betts having a great season last season. Let's see if he can replicate it. And I think this bear is looking at first pitch, Leslie Jordan. Of course. We all know, we all know fancy pants here. Le Leslie Jordan. <laughs> that's that's a really funny card, actually. So the 1987 with uh, style is Chris Sale, who is now a Boston Red Sox. I wonder if he took his scissors with him. He's going to hate some of the Boston Red Sox all-time jerseys if he didn't like the White Sox ones. Nice card. And... This is the, the throwback card, like I was saying at the Nolan Ryan. This is the Mark McGuire from 87. And, and this is just strictly a, a, uh, a promo card. As you see, it's just on the back. It's just got great moments about, uh, let's see, Tops, Tops Bunt 17 and Tops Now. So really promoting just the website. Kind of interesting. Okay, so let's flip through these. Corey Seager rookie card. Again, really nice designs here. Looking at tops 2017. First day it's out. A 
Rajai Davis, who actually is uh, not playing for the Indies anymore. Hit that big home run in Game 7, almost pulled it out for the Indians. All right. Four pack. Again, only Trey Turner so far. So let me just flip through these. Local favorite, Adrian Gonzalez. Daniel Murphy, Jose Bautista going back to the going back to the Blue Jays. Chris Carter, league leader in home runs for the National League, still not signed. Could go to Japan. So I got a bit of a chrome card here, Tyler Flowers. And we got a then and now card with Bryce Harper. It's got an autograph on it, but actually it's just um, a reproduction of the Bowman's Best. So Yeah, it is. that was from a while back, so it's then and now. Kind of cool card. And our first relic. Is an Adrian Gonzalez. That relic. It is not numbered. Not numbered, but an Adrian Gonzalez bat relic. I'm sure that that is great trade bait for me as a lot of L.A. fans, L.A. Dodger fans here. So let's put that over here with the Trey Turner. So our first relic. And then our 1987 card is the David Price. So the throwback card is the David Price. And the, the Rediscover Tops card here, Scott Sanderson. I think that's from 80, 89. 1989. So just a uh, Rediscover Tops. Interesting. So back to the 2017. World Series card for Aldis Chapman. So these a lot of these are the 2017 base cards for Tops Series One. Got a jumbo box we're opening tonight uh, on the day one that it is it is out. Got this at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards in Arcadia, California. Highly recommend checking them out on Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, and at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards.com. So again, going through some of these base cards pretty quickly. Trying to get to we got two relic or sorry, one relic down and one autograph already. Trey Turner and an Adrian Gonzalez rook, uh, relic. Most of these are base cards. All right. Let's 
Stone Tangerine Express IPA. Stone, a big player in the craft beer world. Really like them. And uh, if you ever go to San Diego, please check them out. They're one of the bigger ones and uh, always come out with good stuff. So. We got to mention Chris Bryant here on the as the cover boy for Top Baseball. Twenty seventeen tops series one baseball. Again, a lot of these are base cards. Wish I could go in depth. There's a lot of cards to go through. We're trying to find uh, one more relic, but I think there's a lot of. Uh, I think I've already hit well one relic and one auto already, and that's what's in this jumbo box. But let's see if we can find anything else special in here. It's the number one prospect, Adam Benatendi. You're going to hear a lot about him this year. He's number one prospect this year. The Chrome is Jake Barrett of the Diamondbacks. Then and now, Miggy, Miguel Cabrera, when he was with the Marlins. The 2003, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, when they won the World Championship. And throwback card, 1987, Clayton Kershaw in the 1987. Good looking card. Let's get through some of this base. A lot of horizontal cards I notice in this. Very interesting. So I'm wondering if they have. Uh, Wow, this, this one is almost exclusively horizontal. So again, a lot of this is just base cards uh, in the set. Uh, let's see. Now we go to vertical. Still looking for one relic. Again, I am remiss because I am not looking for brewers because I'm just looking at the cards because they're all new to me. So
Again, a lot of base cards here in this jumbo box. We're looking for that missing relic, Mookie Betts, League Leaders, Joey Votto League Leader. So actually, there's a lot of League Leaders in this one. So I'm thinking that they packed them. So we had a whole bunch of horizontal cards. This one's full of League Leaders. So there's some convention here. A lot of the League Leaders in this one. Another one, Chris Davis. So Memorial Day card, Miguel Sano of the Twins. So we got Mother's Day, Father's Day, and Memorial Day now. Five-tool player, Noah Syndergaard. Really nice card there. Great artwork. I love rock and roll, Joan Jett. If the name wasn't on there, I wouldn't recognize Joan Jett, but there she is. And the 1987 throwback, Josh Bell of the Pirates rookie card. Good looking card and the uh, Don Mattingly, I wish it was, wish this is real, but alas, it is not. It is just a tops. Let's see if I can get that in focus. Goodness gracious! It is just a tops promo card. What's up, John? Can you hear me out there? So a lot of base cards here. Let's. Just flip through this. Chris Bryant. Do you ever think you would have seen this? Chicago Cubs World Series. World Series highlights. Unbelievable. Good for them. Good for baseball. Wearing a St. Louis cap. But I am all about the... Uh, the Cubs being, you know, having a championship. That's okay. It's good for baseball. Alex Reyes. Got to see him pitch in the uh, Futures game in San Diego for the part of the All-Star weekend. That was exciting. Got to see him start for that game. Do not have a Caitlyn Jenner rookie. Sorry, John. <laughs> that would be something special. And, you know, and actually, if, they, if there's a Joan Jett card in here, which I just got, I am not, I would not put it past anyone to have a Caitlyn Jenner card. So you never know what will pop up here. Too low. Yeah. I like I like the Caitlyn Jenner rookie as if, <laughs> as if uh, it wouldn't should be a uh, well it could have been a future prospect if you back a couple of years ago. All right. In close to the end. Still looking for that relic. So let me recap real quick. Trey Turner Auto in the 1987 style. 
can get that in there. And an Adrian Gonzalez Bat Relic. So the guys down at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards are going to really dig that. All right. Again, a lot of base cards. All look really great. Let's see some of that relic. I don't well, actually I, I have three packs left, so I don't know if I want the relic right away. Maybe it'll it'll tease me a little bit. But again, super nice cards. Great photography as always. Graphics are solid. So here's is this the the run of league leaders? Looks like it. Steve, what are you doing? So uh, if you ever go to a sushi restaurant, I highly recommend the Nori Aoki. It is delicious. No Dansby Swansons yet. Have not seen that in here. I was actually surprised that I haven't seen that yet. So here's another, some more of the league leaders. And the legend, Babe Ruth. So we have the we had the Lou Brock legend earlier. This is the Babe Ruth legend. Not autographed, not a relic. Still cool nonetheless. And the chrome is the Jacob de Grom. Just love the, the chrome look. Not numbered, but again, cool card. Then and now, Steven Strasburg. Let's see if I can get that focus. Come on now. Throwback car, future stars. Kyle Schwarber, I remember the uh, Bo Jackson looked like this. It was super great. I think the Rafael Palmero potentially was like this too. I might be wrong on that, but I definitely know the Bo Jackson was. Kyle Schwarber and the Discover Tops. Maybe you know him. Rob Brower of the Rangers. That looks a bit like how I used to hit in high school. Uh, did not hit for average. <laughs> so, Jace Peterson, second baseman for John's Atlanta Braves. Pet Neshek, actually a baseball card collector himself. Uh, he's got a really great story, actually. If you send him his baseball card, I believe, he'll sign it for you. He's actually a big collector. And he actually trades, like, people online, too. Angels, which I will be seeing a lot of. I'm, my buddy Kevin Lyon is a huge Angels fan, and we're going to be doing a lot of collaborations this year. In fact, we're going to be at in Palm Springs this weekend uh, for the California Winter League. So we'll be uh, going to a lot of California, or California, my goodness, this shows you how old I am. The Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. Look at this. 
New Blake Street Bombers. Of course. Who were the old Blake Street Bombers? Anyone? Can anyone tell me who the Blake Street Bombers used to be? These are the, Well, these are the new ones. The Trevor Story and Arenado. Yep. Addison Russell, I believe I was at this game. This is, uh, no, thought that was the NLCS. So here's the run of horizontal cards. So we got some themed cards here, Thor and the Dark Knight. Wow, they're really taking advantage of all this stuff. Let me get that into focus. Thor and the Dark Knight. So Harvey and Noah Syndergaard. Carlos Correa. Joaquin Benoit. Gave up, has given up some. Massive home runs lately, Joaquin Benoit. That's gonna finish my thought. Have I been passing past the uh, the Brewers. Ah, John, there's your Dansby Swanson rookie card. So just like the um, just like the Milwaukee Brewers, Dansby Swanson used to be a Hillsboro hop. So we drink to that. Joaquin Benoit, no relation to Chris Benoit of the WWE. Not, not. <laughs> I can make a pretty bad joke right here, but I will definitely hold on to that one. But no, Johnny is not any relation to Joaquin Benoit or Chris Benoit for that matter. But as we all know, it does not diminish his body of work. All right. Three packs left. This is Topps Series 1 Baseball. So we still got one relic left. Hopefully we can have a, another auto, but I think... I think we already got it. Mike Trout. People like that. Don't know why it's not focusing. Not seeing anything yet. So these are just all base cards at this point. And here's the lead, league leader run that we're going to go through. Chris Bryant, Rick Porcello, Francisco Lindor, and the legend, Ricky Henderson. Did not know that. Four different stints with the A's. Thought he was uh, only an A for a couple seasons, but actually four. So this is an interesting. This is uh, actually uh, out of 99, Jason Hamill. And it has the old Topps logo on there. And it's a bit of a different cardstock as well. So as you can see, let's get close in there. 
out of 99, Jason Hamill. And a bit of a different cardstock. They, and uh, so that's nice. So we got some, uh, definitely some other things. Then and now, Robinson Cano, don't you know? And of course, Judd Apatow, of course. First pitch. Sure, why not? And your 1987 throwback. John Tallwars, Dansby Swanson. So, let me get that in focus. So, Dansby Swanson. So, we drink as the former Hillsboro Hop. Again, drinking. Stone Tangerine Express IPA, as you can see on screen there. And again, another really interesting card. I believe it's a 72, Roberto Clemente. Am I right on that? But wah, wah, it's just a promo card. So we have a couple of these. They're just promo cards, but they're beautiful. They're really nice. Maybe some, uh, yeah. I mean, they're super cool, but they really mean nothing. 73, I thought it was pretty close. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, this was his last card. That was uh, before he died. So, Roberto Clemente hitting 3, 000, getting 3,000 hits in the last day of the season and uh, unfortunately passing away. So, now with the Braves, Sean Rodriguez, unfortunately had a really unfortunate incident earlier. You might want to look that up. That was really unfortunate with his family. But with the Braves right now, Beltre, who I just read in an article, potential Hall of Famer, has Hall of Fame credentials. This guy is a no-brainer for the Hall of Fame. David Ortiz. Please focus camera. So again, 2017 Series 1 tops out today. This is the box. I got it at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards in Arcadia, California. Great design. Matt Adams. When you see him this year, he'll be a shell of himself. Got in super great shape. Saw him at the uh, Dodger Fan Fest last Saturday, Alex Wood. Yasmani Tomas. Now a uh, Tampa Bay Ray, Kobe Rasmus, former Cardinal. Bryce Harper. Former Brave Alex Wood, that's right. I forgot about that. Right, two more packs. So we still got a relic, and it has to be in one of these two. Julio Taran. Come on. Why not you focus? And we got a Brewer here, so Orlando Arcia, rookie card. So we drink.
Cocoa Crisp. Him and Milton Bradley, one of some of the greatest names in baseball. Joey Votto, becoming actually vaulted to one of my favorite players this year. He is absolutely tremendous. Wasn't hitting a lick uh, for a while, but still a really awesome. What a character. David Freeze, World Series hero, Cardinals. So going now, we got the league leaders again. There's a big run of these in here. Verlander, Encarnacion, Joan Moncada, now winning the uh, Chris Sale trade, now a White Sox, Jose Altuve, one of my favorite players, Houston Astros all-time hit leader, uh, for a season that is. Corey Kluber. And our five tool, Giancarlo, don't call me Mike Stanton. Really uh, was awesome to see him this year at uh, the All-Star Home Run Derby. What a player. And what is this see here? <laughs> Very interesting. I did I think this is numbered. Bit of an interesting card here. It's got a, it's it got a bit, bit of a different look to it. Carson Fulmer from the White Sox rookie card. And what's interesting about this is, so you can see it right there. Go out. It's actually numbered, but it's embossed. So 1951 out of 2017. Can that be? Don't know what that is. So that's a bit of an interesting card there. It's got a bit of a different look to it. So I'll put that one aside. First pitch, Victorio Justice. Of course. 1987 throwback, Roger Clemens for the Astros. So the 30 year card, Roger Clemens. Just love that, that the wood border. Let's put that over there. And Ken Griffey Jr. Mariners again. This is not a card. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's just a promo. It's super cool though. I wish this meant something. Maybe it does. I don't know. Maybe I can find out. And the rediscover tops is a 88 Jose Nunez. Okay, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> for, if it's for any worth, it's a Jose Nunez rookie card. Okay, sounds good. So we're still looking for that relic and I think it's in our last pack. I don't think it's in this one. So we got one more relic coming to us. Coming to us. Again, this is 2017. Tops, Series 1, first day it's out. There's our brewer, so we're going to drink up to that. How do you feel about uh, Jay Hay now, John? Still like him? Or is he dead to you? I know I know you like this guy. Freddie Freeman. He should uh, Jason Hayward should be dead to me, but I really liked him when he played with the Cardinals. I was kinda of hoping he'd stay there, but now that I saw his production, I'm not too sad that he left. Now they got Dexter Fowler. So 
So again, these are all base cards. Haven't found our uh, our second relic yet. Ah, the uh, Benatendi again, the number one prospect, just announced recently. Yeah, I think you're right, John. Uh, J. Hay is good for the Cubs. He actually, uh, during that rain delay, actually motivated them. He uh, led the speech that actually got them over the hump, if I'm not mistaken. The rain delay actually helped the Cubs more than it did the Indians. All right, one more pack to go. So let's see what we got. Last pack. Hopefully got the relic in here. Again, we got the uh, Adrian Gonzalez bat relic and the Trey Turner auto. That was the uh, promise, but we, yep, the relic's in here. So last pack, we got the relic. So let's do the last Let's do it last here. Again, super great cards. They all look really nice. I guess the, the real distinguishing part of this is just the, if you look, let's see if I can get, get in on there. Just the, uh, the kind of 3D, real angled look. Super cool. Don't think I've ever seen that on any, anything else. There's no Oso Blanco card. <laughs> Not yet, at least. I haven't seen one. John, am I still, uh, am I uh, blank, I'm uh, sorry, uh, stalled on live over there? Your, uh, your, tech, your, your texts are coming in, but I'm not seeing, uh, I'm actually stalled on here. My video is stalled. Hmm. It's been stalled for a while, I think. So, oh, good. Okay, so that's good to know. Clayton Kershaw, good. Yeah, I'm stalled over here as, as far as I'm looking at it, so that's good to know that it's still going. One day they shall perfect this cellular technology. So again, looking at the last pack of the 2017 yeah, the comments are coming in pretty quickly, but it's like I'm stalled up here on my video. 2017. Tops, first day out. So we're taking a look at it. Stephen Piscotti. Tommy Pham. Here's your league leaders. Trumbo. LeMayhew. Arietta. The Memorial Day card of Jason Hamill. And the Chrome rookie, Matt Strom. Strom. Let's see if I can. Yeah, again, I love the Chrome look. Super awesome. Don't know why it's not focusing. Mike Trout, then and now. So this is a very interesting card. Wow, look at that. Little skinny kid. A big stud on the Angels. So the 87. The 87 card is an Ozzy Smith. Look at that card. What a beautiful card. Love the backflip from Ozzy. 
1987, and in 1987, the Cardinals played and lost to the Minnesota Twins. So a super cool card right there, 30th anniversary. And the Rediscover Tops is the 87 Oakland A's who would be in the World Series the next year against the Dodgers and lost. Sorry, 88, that is. So the last few cards here before we see our last relic. Again, 2017 tops, first day out. Jumbo hobby box, 50 cards a pack. And our brewer, Keon Broxton. So, Stone Tangerine Express IPA. Going down. Whittling down to the last cards here. Matt Reynolds. Not Mark Reynolds. Nelson Cruz. Chris Archer. Goldie. Paul Goldschmidt. Kevin Kermeyer. Ryan Healy. Rookie, Henry Owens. Mitch Moreland. Ryan Zimmerman. And last but not least, the second relic. And what a beauty it is. I am lucky to be wearing this cap and having this as my last relic. 2017 spring training, Matt Carpenter, and really nice. This is what they will be having on the uh, side of their caps, I believe. Matt Carpenter, bit embossed, uh, sorry, uh, spot UV right there. Really nice. So logo patch card from Topps 2017 Baseball Series 1. Matt Carpenter. So that'll do it. Let's look at what we got here as far as our hits. Trey Turner, autograph, Washington Nationals. Not numbered, but very nice nonetheless. In the 1987, look, 30 year anniversary. Adrian Gonzalez, bat relic. What's up, Adrian? I got Adrian on Facebook Live, and I got a bat relic from Adrian Gonzalez. And the second relic is a Matt Carpenter. Let's see if I can get that in a focus. Matt Carpenter, commemorative patch. What's up, Adrian? I got to talk to you later. We got to do some stuff. We got, we got some Dodger stuff to do. I will definitely get in touch with you ASAP. But yeah, so there you go. So we, we just went through the tops 2017, Series 1, Hobby Box. Definitely uh, check it out. Uh, I got this from Hall of Fame Baseball Cards. Let me go through the Chrome. If you get the 2017, let me put these right here. If you get uh, go into Hall of Fame baseball cards and buy the uh, from a hobby shop, you're going to get these awesome Chrome cards. So look at that, Trevor Story. You may not have seen this at the beginning of the show, 
Trevor Story. Look at that. How gorgeous that is. Super cool. Josh Donaldson. Just sick looking cards. Super awesome. I want to say like the refractor. I mean, I'm sure that these are called refractors. I'm not sure if that's what these exactly are. But I think they're, if they're super refractors or, but these are actually special to getting the, this 2017. So you get these and it's only for um, baseball card shops. So if you're going to buy this online, you may not get these cards, but you're going to get these cards. Julio Uras, Urias. Try to roll my R's. I can't do it. But again, beautiful cards here. But yeah, go to a baseball card shop and they will have these. And, and I highly recommend Hall of Fame baseball cards in Arcadia, California. This is where I got this today. On the first day it's out. Rookie card. Luke Weaver. Get in focus, please. Thor. Noah Syndergaard. So some good stuff here. Please get focus. David Dahl, rookie card. And out of 150, Tyler Glass now. Just really awesome cards. So that was Tops 2017. And thank you for joining me on Facebook Live. I will post this uh, other places. And please check me out at Beer Baseball on Instagram. And Beer Baseball on Facebook. Beer Baseball on Twitter. And BeerBaseball.com. Thank you so much. And uh, I will see you next time. I'm going to do some more beer breaks. Uh, thank you to Stone. Stone Tangerine Express IPA. Check that out. Cheers, everyone.